Harmony, will you tell me what happened this morning? I became a junior ambassador for Meningitis Now. A proud day for Harmony and she gets a sash and badge too. Important and happy and exciting. Harmony is proof of what someone who has meningitis can do rather than what they can't. And she'll now become an even more important face and voice in raising awareness of the disease. Harmony was so ill so quickly. It is hard to tell, but there are symptoms. And if they come together, you just know that it is meningitis. So we just that's the main thing. Um, just know the signs and symptoms and also just trust your instincts, really. Um, if you're worried, don't give up and just keep going. And call 999. And call 999. Oh, 111. Meningitis now supported Harmony and her family since her diagnosis. And with her drive and infectious positivity, she was an easy choice to become their first junior ambassador. She's already been campaigning for us up in Westminster. You know, she's fronted the, the World Meningitis Day. It's families like. Uh, Harmony Rose that uh, are really so important to us because, you know, meningitis is still a terrible disease and it strikes with little or no warning. So the more and more information, public awareness we can get out there, then lives will be saved. With students now back at university and all of the issues with COVID, the charity warns that meningitis hasn't gone away. There's normally a peak of infections from now until February. So here's Harmony doing her new job with a reminder of what to look out for. Stiff neck. A stiff neck. Well yeah. done. What was another one? You remember another one? Dislike light. Yes. Another one? Oh, what's the one with the spots on her face? Well, what did you have? You had the... Meningitis rash. A life-saving message from a proud little girl on her first day as junior ambassador. Steve Nibbs, BBC Points West, Bath.